Hey church, I'm coming to you today, obviously, as you can see from a ball field, which is kind of funny because in this chapter, 1 Corinthians chapter 6, uh, we're going to talk about being different than the world. And when I get out here watching my son play, sometimes it's a little hard for me to, if I don't agree with something, to not let somebody know it, right? So it's kind of like, okay, speaking to me a little bit today, we're supposed to be different. Our lives are supposed to look different. That's the reason Paul was writing this to the Corinthians. He knew that they struggled to have a life that looked different than their life looked before uh, they knew Christ. And so he goes over many things in this chapter. They're struggling with sins. And and even he starts off talking about how they are handling quarrels amongst themselves, which should be a reminder of ourselves. Not, I'm not talking about huge issues, but the smaller issues that we have amongst each other. Instead of making big deals about them, we should come with a, a forgiving spirit, come with a, a compromise, meet together, try to find peace with one another. That's what he's saying. That's what, as believers, we should be able to do. And he also uh, gives us a list of sins in this first part of, of the chapter. And he says, uh, I love this part he says and that is is what some of you were he's describing he's talking about these sinners he's saying hey listen that's who you were but you were washed and you were sanctified you were justified in the name of the lord jesus christ and by the spirit of our god so guess what now you are different so act differently and the same the same message is true for you and me today um whether it's uh, sins of sexual immorality, as he goes on to talk about, sins of our body, when realizing our bodies don't belong to us, they belong to the Lord. Everything we should do should be to give him glory, that we are just called to be set apart and different. And he sums it all up at the end. And I love this. Do you not know that your bodies are temples of the Holy Spirit, who is in you, whom you have received from God? You are not your own. You were bought up at a price. Therefore, honor God with your bodies. Church, can I just remind you today that Everything that we are, is, is, it comes from Christ. There's nothing that we are on our own. Uh, we belong to him, and everything we do in our life should honor him and be to bring him glory and praise. And so that, may that be a challenge for you today. Hope you have a great day, and hopefully I can keep it together here at the ballpark today.